Janik Sinner is back at the French Open after spending a month sidelined by a hip injury. Janik Sinner has given an update on his hip injury after undergoing tests ahead of the French Open. The world number two was forced to pull out of the Madrid Open ahead of his quarterfinal and missed his home tournament in Italy. There were doubts over whether he'd be ready to play in Paris but Sinner revealed that his latest checks gave him the green light to compete. Sinner also received a message from one of his rivals, Carlos Alcaraz, during his brief injury break. The Spaniard has also been battling a physical issue and joined Sinner in skipping the Italian Open. Sinner has not played a match in almost a month after realizing his hip injury was more of an issue than he initially thought. The 22-year-old beat Karen Kachanov in Madrid the day after he was first seen stretching and taking painkillers but he later withdrew from the tournament and has been sidelined ever since. There were reports that he would skip the French Open but Sinner explained that he committed to playing after receiving test results for the injury, confirming that the hip was no longer a problem. Yeah, I mean, I am not concerned anymore about my hip. The last tests we made, they were very positive. That's why I am here. I said I come only here if the hip, it's in a good shape, he said. I want to be part of a grand slam if my body allows it. We decided after the last tests we made. They were very positive so we were working very hard every day trying to get back in shape. And that's it, really. I mean, we have been working very hard. Although his body is no longer a concern, Sinner is well aware that he is undercooked coming into the tournament. He continued, the general physical shape is not perfect. I didn't play tennis nearly three weeks, which is quite a lot, no, before a grand slam. But look, I just try to play day by day, no? This is a little bit different approach of a tournament than it used to be, you know because hopefully getting through to the first round can help me a little bit, finding my rhythm. Most importantly it's going to be the mental side, no, of being mentally ready, accepting things what could happen on the court, and then we see what I can do. Sinner's opening match against Christopher Eubanks will take place 27 days after his last outing on a court, when he beat Kachanov in Madrid. And the Australian Open champion has barely played since then.